this is our play of the week analysis. We're going to watch this real time several times, and then we're going to analyze this play, see how we feel about the call that was originally made and the call that was eventually made on this play. Initially, the lead ruled this as a player control foul on number 50, the ball handler dribbler. Replay changed it to a blocking foul by our primary defender in blue. Now we have player control of the rebound as our ball handler dribbler starts his dribble. So lead and center should be on their horse to get down the court as fast as possible to make an accurate ruling on the play. Here we see that our primary defender has obtained legal garden position. Let's see if he maintains this through the entire dunk. On the gather, our primary defender still has legal garden position, has obtained it and maintained it, and appears to be displaced by the ball handler dribbler from Lee's angle. Now we're going to look at this from center's angle. Again, our primary defender has obtained legal guard position, but seems to maintain it, and shifts only his right foot in his plane. He never shifted the left foot and never changed his vertical plane position. From my perspective, this is a player control foul by a ball handler dribbler but I have no problem if someone rules us a blocking foul. We definitely need to have a whistle on this play. 